Hey hey, Jelly Toast here, back with more Final Fantasy XII. Picking up right where we left off last time, I am going to go through the doors, stone door, and find out where it's going to take me. I see buildings in the distance. Did we reach Arcadians? If we did, that was a very short trip. Is it empty? Is it deserted? Yeah, it Ew, sewers smell disgusting. Okay, so it's not abandoned. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wait, what? Their eyes never... They... What, you're making... We're staying next to us. Oh. A different self. Their entire conversation just whoosh right over my head. I old Arcades. Oh no wait. Oh no wait, it's coming back to me. Arcades is the place with all the flying cars. No. I remember there was a either a side quest or something. Or, oh, that's what I wanted to do. I want to earn more money in, um, in whatchamacallit. This causes berserk. Remedies, I have 90. I think I'm fine. Chronos tier, stone petrify, whatever. I have enough of those. Um, oh, antidotes. I need a bunch of those because we're constantly getting poisoned. Eye drops, sure. Uh, potion. Don't really need them. I don't really have items to sell, whatever. Thanks for not selling any weapons. I think it's about high time I need to upgrade their stuff. But yeah, one of the side quests or actual quests I have to do in Arcadies involves me running around on those cars. Oh, I'm not looking forward to it. A proper gent? What is a proper gentleman doing here? Why am I only picking up knots of rust? Is this... Was I not supposed to take them? Are you going to reward me with something better after? <laughs> that was one thing that messed me up in Chrono Trigger, like... You can get all the treasure chests, but if you leave it for another time, it becomes something stronger and better. I'm like, frack! Oh, Chrono Trigger was an awesome game. I love Chrono Trigger. Like, a lot of people think just because a game is old, it can't be amazing or good. And I'm just like, no, heck no! Like, graphics, they do help with, like, getting me into the game. But, you know, if the story and the gameplay is solid enough, I'll still like the game anyway. Like, for example, Nier, I didn't play it until earlier this year. It's an old game. Graphics aren't, you know, top-notch. But, oh man, it's one of my favorite games now. Like, I love Nier. The story and the message that it told. The way the characters were portrayed. Like, everyone's different stories. It just... It's not just a typical feel-good, oh, hey, you saved the world kind of story, but it's more real. Like, based on- ooh, Imperial. If credentials? I have not. No point in lying. Be off with you, commoner. Oh no, I probably have to, like, talk to people now. Well, well, well. There's a cypress or eyes. Didn't think I'd be seeing you again. Not here. Ew, you look like a douche. Oh, wonderful. Enter the street here. Pirate will do well to smile. Wouldn't want to sour his reputation. Get rid of that soul patch, dude. Ew. You know this guy? An old friend. He's a street ear. A peddler of rumor and hearsay by the name of Jules. He bet a gale given to him by his own mother. And shave it by half to pay for her funeral. I don't understand what that means. I just know he's a creepy dude. Sometimes an ear with a tight purse of strings, the order of the day. But a pirate decides he fancies going up in the world. The city? No way. 
Knowledge is power. Power has a way of opening doors, boy. Now, a fool buy a sack of feathers for his pillow, but a wise man will buy a whole stinking cockatrice and get his pillow of meat into the bargain. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, so, yeah, I have the money. I just want to go. Bright boy, you learn fast. I call this meeting to order. Tell me, boy, heard any rumors in town? Oh, no, I have to go talk to everyone. Ah! I need to hear before I talk. A boy would do well to see what his ears can pick up off the streets. I was wondering why there were so many people. City's up these stairs. Me head says all I've got to do is walk up, but, but me feet are trembling. What with the assassination and all. Ooh. He turned into a nervous seek. Spent some time in the city once, gathering up all the information I could lay me hands on. It turns out some of them weren't true. And before long, I ended up back down here. So it it all changes from Arcadian vulgar to like broken people. I have plans to go and see with my bow. He's kept me waiting for hours. I expect he's lost. He's so provincial. I think he just ditched you, lady. <laughs> did these treasure chests spawn again, or did I miss them the first time around? Uh, was there anyone here? You! Best not speak to me, lest my ill luck rub off on you. I lost everything. Everything! Oh, uh, if I'd only had to write information. I think I really do have to talk to everyone. Oh, lordy lord. Lordy lordy lord! <laughs> Wait, there were people. Prop budget. Otto. You think you might not not stare at me? I'm in the midst of a very important conversation. What's your conversation? Fine, be like that, you douche. You going on from here? On from here, Arcades. You go there, you best watch yourself. People think they fuck better from a living chocobo. They thought they could make a profit on I turned back if I was you. I just need to know something important, but I don't know what I'm looking out for. Something exactly. I'm saving me guilt to get out of here and up there. Why, well, I've got a bag full of coin put aside already. That is, I had a bag full of coin. But someone come along and stole it. Grrr, I was sure it'd be as safe as housing that barrel, too. So, I'm looking for a barrel? I can't interact with any barrels, though. Oops. Oh, I'll tell you a secret, but it stays between us two, right? I spied something in the just now. What? Wouldn't you like to know? It's a pack of coin just thrown in a barrel, it was. But more like that, so it'll be me oyster. Oh, don't go tell anyone in your hair. I'ma tell this man! I know, I know the dude. Beasley! I know who has it! Beasley, no! This oyster man has it! The oyster man has it. Trying to go up to your case, perchance. I know the type. Hopes and but never any knowledge. Okay, just everyone, just tell me the knowledge, please. To go to the same without the proper knowledge. Why? It's just the same thing. And I'll tell you something else. It was knowledge what brought them senators to their knees, and that's the truth. Still want to go into the city? Yes, because I'm going to destroy them. No, where the alley of muted size got her name? See, there's two kinds of people here. Them as want to go up to the city, them as want to keep those people down here where they belong, tell them lies and spreading misinformation to confuse them. Them poor ones what made it up. They're the ones who were signed, see? You weren't in up to see, were ya? I don't understand these people's accents. Are you trying to be English? Australian? Eh, you know I mean? I'm ready to begin a new life up in the city, that's for sure. I've been tricked out of all I own before, but this time I'll go prepared. You do it. You do you, Granny. Hello there. Hmm? Oh, don't bother trying to talk to her. My sister's not stopped looking off into the distance since her fellow went up to the city. He left you! I'm sorry. Wait. Isn't this the same place as it? What? Oh my gosh! Koopo Podi Podolo. They're so cute. Oh my, a gourmet tour he promised us. Well, we had his curds and whey. That's disgusting! Isn't curds like fermented milk or cheese or something? 
Oh wait, I'm back into the old part of town. But man, those wiggles were super cute. Why did I miss them the first time? Mila Bros back. The prior enjoy the clowns come back with tales from the city. So how was it? Don't tell me. You made a mint, didn't you? Not for all of us, I what? Mila did set up a shop. The competition. Let your guard down for a moment. Next door will s over will slip a knife in your ribs. I've wanted to come home. But you lost all your money. Do I have to really talk to everyone? I'm blue and hungry. Me mom and me grand keep telling me that sitting's best when you're hungry. But it don't seem to be working for me. Maybe if I have a chat with me mom, I'll forget about the empty belly. Maybe not. I'm blue and hungry. I know I'm not the best at accents, but eh, I'm trying. It's good to be home. Those who went over the city and there came back, they either made it or fell by the wayside. Forgotten. But not me. So you want to tell me information? Like what? Exactly what kind of information am I looking for? Hey, kid, why are you running? When she gets going, she don't go half on. I only hope her granddad sits straight. Ain't my place to worry about, I suppose. Who are you talking about? Oh, her. The granddaughter claims she's seen a great airship. Of course, I thought it was the Alexander. That being the biggest I know of. Her description. <gasps> Maybe this is information that we're looking for. Um. So do I have to talk to anyone else? Seriously, I'm off tomorrow, so destiny. Mark my words, I'll be the richest man in Arcadia soon. I'm bringing a diamond big enough to prove it. So soon? Ah, <sighs> no. I knew it would come in time. Spare me the diamond, just stay true. I'll be waiting. Um, okay. Anything else? Anything else? Fresh art. Who am I? Ain't it plain to see? I'm one of the many what tried to make it up in the city and fell back down here. If only I hadn't signed that paper. Yeah, it was an ardent with the rest of them. All it took was one broker, one find an agreement, and nary a scruple in sight. Find them all. Do you want something? Oh, I'd get to the city, up these stairs, off to the west. Entrance up there. Better be prepared, mate. Oh! Me and Dad's the head of one of them big entry prizes? Big entry prizes? He was the head. He ain't the head no more. There's lots of them around here. Them as used to be heads, I mean. They weren't just heads. They were eds. Do you wonder why I say you're doing not they come, they go? I've done me a bit for the Empire, that's why I've earned me rest. Don't you ever fancy a rest, youngin? No rest for the people who are trying to do good in the world. Never any rest. Uh, try to start out with no money, so don't even bother trying to relieve us of it. I don't need your money. I have enough of my own money. The treasure chest did spawn again, because I clearly remember coming back here. What am I doing? Gathering tidbits of knowledge, that's what. Think I got back to time like you oldies? Cause I ain't- I'm not old, it's you as you. I played many a man false in the city, so I did. Of course I was being played just the same, though I didn't know that. I ran so many men. That's all I can do now to hide myself in here and I don't run into any- But one of your clients is right there. They're- these are people who are telling information about each other in the city and they don't realize that they're there. Brother- brother mine. We'd only bought them cockroaches when we had the chance, why? We'd be rich men today, so we would. Brother, brother mine, cockroaches meat's not as as tasty as they'd have you believe. This recent interest in the bad, you mark my words. Nah, cockroaches or no, our fate's the same. Do I have to talk to the cockroaches too? Talk to me. It's an old but dignified fowl. Maybe like that's why the meat's not good, because he's old. Ah, oh, fine, I'll try talking to literally everyone. Tire swapping tidbits of information in the stream, but there's not else I fancy doing to until that's a problem with success. My mouth is getting tired. Headed to the city, are you? Going to be a soldier like the rest of them? I wish you luck. You go up there, you die a little inside. I <laughs> a part of you goes cold and black. Just like them senators. I'd stay down here by you. I hate government. I would hate to be in a power with precision of power. That's a face I dislike. It's the eyes. Beady, shiny. Eyes that see the narrow show. You know, sort. Who do I speak of? Vayne, of course. Oh, he's gross. Only a man like that could do what he's doing. Killing his own two brothers in cold blood for opposing the Empire. Ah, I believe it. Old Arcadies, that is. People here, they all took their dreams up to the city and had them stripped away and fell back down. Almost done, almost done. Here's an unfamiliar face. If you're hoping to go to the city, let's find yourself information like that. Artisan gentry. 
It was a long time the day. The Emperor's assassination? Ancient history, my friend. So what new information am I looking for then? Come to buy information? Or perhaps to sell? Knowledge is what makes the town work. I've had a gill or chop to spare. Make an offer for what you know right now. No thanks, I don't want to divulge my secrets too quickly. Now this is new. Plenty of worms come about around here, but not many of them are sort with two legs. Come to make a fortune in the capital? A word of advice, worms. Turn back while you've still some gill to your name. Excuse you, sir, but I can earn all the gill I want. It's called trial mode, and it's super cheap. Okay. I think I just about talked to everyone. Yeah. She. Oh, wait. Yeah, look, there's some good deal when he sees it. So, I was about some Moogles, and I ain't about eight of them. Just kind of take a lot. It's a bargain. They keep their dance. <gasps> you tricked them! Seek over there seems a bit dodgy. This is an emergency resort. I haven't seen peddling anywhere. Oh, all the people that still say Arcadian vulgar, I haven't talked to them. I've been told that joining the watch is a good way to get into the world. Yeah, others tell me it's a hard life, full of hard choices. What to do? What to be? Well, that's the problem with having too much information. It's difficult to make up your mind. That's why you gotta be wise. Imperial City of Arcades. When I get a bit bigger, I'm gonna be a soldier there. I think I'm done. My tongue is getting the workout of its life. Ugh. <laughs> right? I talked to you all, right? Yeah, I did. No, I didn't. Arcadian Vulgar. My grand's got me worried. She was talking about going to see and making a fortune. Making a fortune? She's old! You never know. Rich. Young or old, you can make a fortune. Easily! I know who has your money. <laughs> Let me help you. Treasure chest. Not a rust. Wait, no, I already talked to you. You're disparaged. Okay, thank you. Bye. Naysayer. Wait. Treasure chests. I've done about 17 minutes of talking. Arcadian Boulder? Come to your hotel, perhaps. There's a lot to be learned from the stories of the past. A lot you youngsters seem to have forgotten. To your peril. You show a little more respect for fairy tale. Okay, thanks. Crazy coot. I think I talked to you. I should stop checking the treasure chest because they barely give me anything. Please, let me be done. I caused me to order. Tell me where I heard any rumors in town. Seek selling moogles. Moogle trading, you don't say. A boy has seen the dancing moogles? Go and tell them. They just told me. To a boy. What? Do I actually have to go to the moogles now and say. I. I hope I'm doing the right thing? Why can I not read maps? This way. This way, this way. Oh, my tongue is tired. Yeah. This is definitely only a two video recording session. Now we hear where to be sold. That is not what we were told. And they're dancing even faster now. Okay. Oh, so do I have to listen to everyone's things, and then go to Jules and be like, this is what I heard, and then he'll be like, okay, now fix the problem? Or, you know, go to the person and tell them what's what? This is annoying. This is boring. Yet necessary. Gosh. Oh, no, Imperials. No, where the heck is... Where is he? Was I here? What the heck? Wait. Do I have to talk to the Seek now? It's not you. Wait, do I have to talk to the Seek too? This is stupid. This is annoying. I just wanted to get to the fighting. I don't want to get to the story. I don't want to go through this nonsense. Um, where's Seek? Where's Seek? So where is Jules? 
I told the Moogles. So then... What? <sighs> I'm gonna have to look up a walkthrough. Uh, old Arcades. Uh, walkthrough. I really don't like using walkthroughs, but if I'm really stuck... But sitting on a crate nearby? Wait, what? Okay. I spoke to the Sikh. I spoke to the Mughals. This walkthrough better be correct. He should be where he was, but sitting on a crate nearby. I don't want to be lost forever, man. That's not you. That's not you. Wait, if, where am I going? Going back up. Oh, camera, stop moving. I'm starting to get dizzy. The heck? He's not here. <sighs> you lied to me. Walk through. Oh, I need to take a short breather while this page loads getting dizzy okay um shouldn't be a problem I'll set out you know I blah blah run around and say you talk to everyone pay attention to what they have to say in both areas of our old Arcades I did talk to Jules with more he'll tell you information to a man named Beasley what The causes a ruckus. But mine's not Beasley, mine's the Moogles. What? Old Arcades. Walkthrough. Moogles. Uh. The Moogles ain't. Um. Close their abductor. Computer dance multiple times. Okay. This is really pissing me off. The Moogles found out they're being sold. And then I went to the, talk to the Sikh. He doesn't seem to be too bothered that the Moogles know that they're being sold. Because all the walkthroughs I'm looking at right now, they're all like, talk to Beasley. Oh my gosh, I need to... <sighs> Shady Seek. And then... And then the Moogles. So is Jewel somewhere around here then? Distinguished Elder. Maybe I will try talking to Beasley? Returning... Uh... Beasley was... Beasley was... Here? No, he was... Down here? I'm starting to get really nauseous. No, Beasley was in the second area. Um, you know what, I'm going to pause this episode and I'll be back when I have some idea of what the heck I'm doing. So, um, be right back, I guess. Okay, so Jules was right here. I don't know why I didn't see him before. I'm pretty sure he wasn't here before, but anyways. He's here. Please just let me continue. Told him just as I told you? Good boy! Thank you. I'm not sure what any of this has to do with going up in the world. Oh? What is the power of knowledge, my boy? See? It begins. What begins? A brawl. 
But bro, the Moogles are riot. Yes, I want to see the Moogles fight. Bring out your spears. I won't get to see them fight. Yeah, it's a chance. Thanks, Jules. For 1,500 gil. Never thought you'd go for such a meager price. How did you know that words are worth gil un uncountable? Here's some words for you. Shut the hell up. <laughs> Prodigal Bonanza son, come back to the Imperial Roost. See? Words of words mean the value of these. Bah. Humbug. ばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばばば
from regular Arcades and see where it leads me. So, yeah, sorry, this episode was just a lot of talking and walking. No real cutscenes, no real battling. But that cutscene when they first got into Arcades and Pinella and Bosch and Vaughn were talking was super cute. But yeah, I need to go pass out now because I'm super dizzy and I'm getting really tired. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Stay toasty.